What's up, guys? Thank you so much for coming back to the channel and checking out another reaction video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, all that stuff you already know how to do. And as always, hit that bell so you never miss when I upload a brand new video because it could be the video that you requested. Now, I got this video requested quite a few times, and I'm really, really excited to react to this because, believe it or not, um, around 2015, 2016, I was actually a really big Black Veil Brides fan. Um, but it was one of those things where if you were a Black Veil Brides fan, you didn't tell anybody you were a Black Veil Brides fan uh, just because you got made fun of a lot, uh, whether it was the makeup, the hair, the style. But I really, really enjoyed the legacy, Fallen Angels, and the songs around that period. I really enjoyed that album. Um, there are a lot of songs on there that I really, really enjoyed. And um, I would play them over and over and over and over. And the funny thing is, when people would ride in, ride in my truck with me and they would hear it, they would like it. I'm like, wow, this song's really good. Who is this? I'm like, oh, it's um, Black Veil Brides. And I'm like, you listen to Black Veil Brides? Mother, you just said it was a good song. What's, what are we talking about here? But anyway... I saw they dropped this song and I was I, I was gonna listen to it, but then I was like, you know what? Let me just wait a day or two and see if I get a request for it. And sure enough, coming through my Twitter DMs, about three people, you gotta hear bleeders, you gotta hear bleeders, you gotta hear bleeders. So, without any further ado, ladies and gentlemen, this is Black Veil Brides, Bleeders. Let's go. I really like this feel to it. This like Charlie and the Chocolate Factory kind of Lenny Snicket's almost Oliver Twist all had a mashup. I, 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 I really, really like this aesthetic right here. Hold on. Where the hell did that come from? Hold on. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. I thought that was a barber's chair at first. I don't know what it is now. Stay in the light of fame. They want you there to save a life. But only if you're dressed in white. Yo, this, 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 <laughs> hey, this shit go hard. I love it. I love it so much. Oh my God. I love it so much. Wow. Yeah. I, I don't know what I was expecting, but I don't think I was expecting this. This is, this, this is awesome. Like I could almost hear this being like, 
a WWE theme song. Um, wow, that's awesome. It, it sounds really, really good. So this man's like the crow if the crow was a barber. This, this, this man's like the crow if the crow like he's a vi that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Like I, I I so it was a barber's chair and like you got the chief of police, you got the judge, you got a priest all coming in to get a get a shave up, get cleaned up, and it's like he can see the the bad that they've done and he's <laughs> taking a little bit more off the top than he was supposed to, if you know what I mean. Oh my god, I, I really, really like this. You know what I was thinking? Um, I'm gonna go back a little bit because look, if you're a Black Veil Brides fan, I doubt you're gonna not want to hear this again. Um, so I'm gonna rewind a little bit. You know what I was thinking right about I'm I'm looking for the still shot that I that I'm thinking of. Right right here. I'm a big fan of the show Once Upon a Time. Like all the the storybook characters come to life, would this not be the perfect Rumple Stiltskin? Like, don't get me wrong, I I, I think Rumple or Mister Gold was played by an incredible actor, but if not him, would this not have made a perfect Rumple Stiltskin? Just saying. Hey, let's take it from right here. Top beating his wife. The priest trying to take advantage of people. Oh my god. are awesome.
back just a little bit. I want I want to go back just a little bit to right here. So the kid comes in and the kid doesn't see why he did what he did. The kid doesn't see the 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 cop that beat his mom or or at first at first when I when I noticed all three were the same kid, I thought it was him and he was going after people who who did wrong to his mother. Whether it was the priest who tried to take advantage of her, the cop who beat her, the judge who missentenced her, whatever the case may be. But I think this is a very powerful part in the music video. So right here, you got the little kid come in. And the little kid doesn't see why he did what he did. The little kid just sees this man just murdered three people. Whether, whether justified or not, he murdered three people. And this right here, I feel like, <laughs> is a visual metaphor for something we're taught at a very young age. Two wrongs don't make a right. But wouldn't this technically be three wrongs? Because the little kid... I, either way, either way. It's like two wrongs don't make a right. You can have the best intentions of the world, but you're still going to have to pay for what you've done. I, I, I could be way off with this metaphor. Music is subjective, um, and this is what it means to me. Just because you were doing what you thought was right doesn't mean you were right. Love it. Oh, I love it. I think it's awesome. I, I, I think it's absolutely awesome. Um, it's such an incredible song. Such an incredible song. Captivating. The theatrics were awesome. The vocals were awesome. The music was awesome. The the imagery was awesome. It's, um... Wow, that's... I don't, I don't know what else to say about it. It's it's just freaking awesome. Hey, Annabelle, what do you think? You don't make eye contact with Annabelle. I apologize. Uh, but anyway, um, yeah, I think it was incredible. I, I absolutely, absolutely loved it. Um, thank you all so much for being here. I truly appreciate it. Um, wow. I'm going to listen to that at least 10 more times while I edit these videos. And uh, I could really, as a as a big wrestling fan, as you can clearly see, the titles and the action figures and stuff behind me, I could really see that being a wrestling theme song. And um, that's awesome. Thank you all so much for being here. Truly appreciate it. I love you. God bless you. I'm praying for you. I'll see you at the next one. I'm out.